So this female Nigerian comedian came out and was appreciating Tunde Ednot because it was actually Tunde Ednot that posted her that made people to get to know her and you know follow her. Tunde Ednot is one of the bloggers that actually made her popular. So I came across this um, video she made. She was appreciating Tunde and at the same time and somehow calling out the elite in the entertainment industry. You know saying that it's very difficult for most of them to help you without wanting to sleep with you. In fact, I'll let you all hear her speak, then I'll drop my two cents after she must have finished. See, from the beginning down to this moment, I'm so thankful to Tunde Ednot. You will not understand. Do you think it's easy for people to come out in the industry? Do you know how people suffer in the industry? Do you know what people go through, especially girls in the industry? If this one don't want to mark you, if this one don't want to do this one, if this one don't want to do that one, if you that money that they ask for, that one different. If you call, you tell me, say, bring 50k before I go, that one different. They don't want to do that one, they go say they want to mark. A person like me now, as I get a person like Tunde, no way help me. Eh? I know experience all those ones. You get, everything just goes smoothly. I just the reasons of kind things. I just the hear some kind of stories. Now, they, I they thank God though. No, for real. You think, do you, do you think it's easy? If they say to Nigeria, they're going to say that because they knock me, they, make, uh, hey, they post me, or they, make, they promote me. Now, the only saving grace where I get, do you get? Hi! Today I not. God will bless you. God will bless you! Oh! This industry, I never start with you now. No worry, no worry. When I go start to talk, God forbid. Now, not go kill all of you now. All of you now. Not go kill now. Thank God, say they promote me for free. Eh? Thank God. And for those of you now, they go, they knock them. I pity you. You know, get, you know that you want to knock the rich where you go blow. Man, I'll tell you the truth. Whoever is asking you for sex before help, that is rubbish. It better me they ask you for money than to say they want to knock you before they help you. Because if they might knock you, and at the end of the day, if I see you watch the video, now you go to tell and say, you don't see that get away pass. Now me pass now. Now the person where you knock, now they know. Do you understand? Uh -huh. And mommy, I don't take anything for granted though. All the blogs that posted me, everybody, everybody that contributed to my growth. I'm so thankful. For real. People in this industry, they just want to knock you before they help you. They don't want to, they don't want to help genuinely. They don't want to, to help you for free. Mm. Thank God though. Because I get bad character first of all. Mm. You're blessing God, you're no. You're making it easy for me. I don't knock anybody yo, for anything for the industry. Not agree. Not mind these people. Don't mind them. Do not. Thank you so much today, Not, I love you. And to all the blogs and everybody that have contributed to my growth. I'm emotional today. I already remember the kind things. I honestly don't want to believe that all the females in the entertainment industry that have made it this day had to sleep with one elite or the other to get to the top. I don't want to believe that because I've noticed that this is average Nigerian man's mindset they believe that as a woman for you to get there you must have slept with someone you must have slept with one elite or the other you must have a godfather you know you must have someone that is sleeping with you you know to help you or to push you or to give you money to get there or to make you rich or make you famous that is average nigerian man's mentality and this thing is not entirely true there are a lot of women out there who have made it today out of their own hard work it must not necessarily be that they are sleeping with someone or they have someone that is sponsoring them that is still the mindset we all have when you see a woman that is successful today or you see a woman that is rich you automatically believe that she has one godfather out there or one sugar daddy that is sponsoring her lifestyle that is sponsoring her it's not entirely true my people <laughs> let's just try and erase this mindset i know it will be very difficult for us to erase it because these men are not even helping matters that is what they want people to believe that is why they keep trying their best to sleep with any woman that wants to get to the top and you will be a victim if you are desperate once you are desperate to make it you are desperate to be there you will always be a victim to these men that is what they want people to believe that is why they always do it before they help you they want to sleep with you because that is what they want people to believe that is the impression they want everybody out there to you know have so as a young girl you want to get to the top you will have no option than to you know than to give yourself to them because they will make you believe that without sleeping with them you can never make it it's a lie from the pit of hell as a young girl out there you can make it 
you can make it without having to sleep with anybody, without having to sell your body. You can believe in yourself and work hard. There are a lot of women out there who made it and they did not sleep with anybody. They did not sell their bodies. Don't let them make you believe that you have to sleep with someone before you make it. Don't. Don't fall to these their lies. These their lies are from the pit of hell. Don't fall for it. Do your best. Get a skill. Make sure you have talent. Just be good at whatever you are doing. And be consistent and put in the necessary work. Then pray to God to help you and keep doing what you are doing. Before you know it, your time will come. God will send people that will help you without wanting to sleep with you or anything. And by being consistent, your hard work and talent will announce you and attract people that will help you to come your way and help you before you know it, you don't blow. The number one rule is not to be desperate. Just let God do it. Wait on God's time and be patient and keep doing what you're doing. Wishing all the young, talented girls in the entertainment industry struggling to make it all the best. May the good Lord send you all your destiny helpers and help you get to the top and announce you to the world with ease. In Jesus' name, amen. Let me know what you think at the comment section. Please don't forget to hit the like button. Feel free to share this video and follow my page for more. Subscribe to my channel if you're watching from YouTube. Bye. Ciao, ciao.